We're always laying the black pipe. Today we're gonna lay some white pipe. I got a call that a new septic was getting dropped and they were gonna tie into the existing, but turns out they couldn't drop it that far down. So, new line stuck in the house. That's a reed deburr tool. Burr. I'm priming and glowing, believe it or not. It's just not purple, it's clear. Only gentlemen can use the clear stuff, remember that. So I got the call and I came out to the house. I looked at it and I just tried to think about it as quick as possible on how I was gonna put this thing back together because I ran to the supply house and people lived in this premises so I was gonna have to have it put together by the end of the day. Now it would have been pretty simple to think about but there was this pump that was involved and the inside guts were rearranged, kind of like your sister. And it made me think about how I had to tie this sucker in. So, this is the future vent, and it's gonna get tied back into the drain. We're gonna cut this sucker off right here, and then tie it back in. And you'll notice that I drop it down to the pump, because, ooh, dirtypackjack.com. Kank tops are coming soon. You'll see that the future vent drops down to the pump, because the pump won't turn on without that. And I didn't feel safe just tying it into the pump, and not the sanitary system as well for the drip back. I also should have used the 3 inch Y and 8th, but I used the long sweep, but you'll pull a toilet. 